No, Felipe! Draw the card, and draw the card. Alright guys, it's Spartan King again, and I am here with another Brawl deck list for you. This one this time is a Mono Black Ayara. Look at that emo goth chick. This is black. Blackity black. Like, just think of the blackest thing that you can think of. And then I want you to take a black magic marker and fill that in with that blackness. And then I want you to shoot that into space. And then from there, I want you to close your eyes. And that's about as black as this black deck gets. Here we go. Mono black Ayara. So what she does is a three cost mono black. Whenever she or another black creature enters the battlefield under your control, each opponent loses a life and you gain one life. So pretty good. And then she has the ability to sacrifice another black creature and draw a card. So let's see how this goes. We got Deadweight, Falmire Knights, and a bunch of other cards. In fact, here, let me just do this for you today. Let me just do this for you up here. All right, so we got a Falmire Knight, a Gutter Bones. Obviously, you want to sacrifice him and bring him back several times. Knight of the Ebon Legion, get that one cost guy to go out there and start ramping himself up. Deadweight to get that enchanted creature to that minus two, minus two. Really good for a one cost. Spark is destroy target creature or planeswalker. You have to sacrifice a creature in this particular case or pay four, but it is a one cost. We're going to try to get a lot of low cost in this one. This guy can flash in, boost up your knights like, well, Falmire Knight or Knight of the Ebon Legion. Burglar Rat, get those hands. You get you put them on the field, you make them discard a card, and then you sacrifice them with Ayara. So all good things. Eternal Taskmaster enters tapped, but you can pay three, and if you do, you return him from the graveyard back to your hand. He is like a gutter bones, except a little bit more costly, but still with the Ayara effects, we're gonna be sacrificing a lot of creatures to get this guy out there. So whenever Eliza Top enters the battlefield, amass that one. So sacrifice him, gain something out of it. Order of Midnight, get those cards back from the graveyard to your hand to use them again and again. Afterlife pops up there. Piper the Swarm can create some rats for you to sacrifice on top of that. You can use Iara's effect several times, draw off a card and keep you moving forward. Priest of the Forgotten Gods, never really like having her, but I always had glad I got her. Yarrick's Fin Lurker, he enters the battlefield, each opponent exiles a card. So it's like the Burglar Rat, but he exiles instead of discards. Dreadhorde Invasion, create those little guys. Elder Spell, kill all of them stinking planeswalkers we don't want to see any more of. Staple of all Brawl decks. Midnight Reaper, gotta love him. Draw that card. Get a little bit more card draw. He should be ramping up a little bit faster than your opponent. Zombie tokens now have Death Touch, which is just sweet with this. Bloodthirst Aerialist, this guy can get pretty big. When you have life gain, he can get 1-1 one, one and just gets bigger and bigger from there. Murderous Rider, because he's a black creature and he's awesome. This guy, target, discard a card. You got a lot of discard cards to your opponents in this one. That's what we want to go for. Drill Bit, Foreboding Fruit. The Price of Fame, the Spawn of Mayhem, Rankle, all these guys are all staples now. Cavalier of Night, get that Command the Dread Horde. And Liliana, because when your creature dies, you draw a card on top of the effect of Ayara, so it's stacking on us. Boas is Citadel, Sacrifice 10 non, you can do damage. This is a really good card. You can always, it's kind of like, uh, <sighs> what's the red card? Enchanted. You in the enchantment, you get to basically look at the top card of your library anytime, and you can play the top card of your library anytime. Um, the thing is that you're paying life to do this, and with AR on the field, it's not nearly as killer to you. Uh, I would also the Cauldron of Eternity spell cost two last cast for each creature card in your graveyard. 
Whatever creature you control dies, put it on the bottom of its owner's library. Bunch of lands, and I have a witch's cottage. In fact, so in looking at this, I actually just thought of something that I needed to put in here. Witch's oven and cauldron's familiar. That combo needs to be in this as well to keep things moving forward. It took out the eternities for that, so I think it's going to be a better selection overall. All right, guys, let's see what it does. All right, get that rat out and get rid of this stuff in our hands. And rankle for the winds. Really? I still think Feather the Redeemed is a better Boros commander for this. He's so much better. Unless you just got a ton of double strikes in there or something, you really want to plus up. But, whatever. Do it! Come on. Get rid of something. There you go. Yep, I like you getting rid of stuff in your hand. Give it up. Just, just get rid of it. Just get it out of there. Get it out. <clears throat> you don't need that little pesky card in your hand. Well, that's not very helpful, is it? Go, Tajik. Go for that Davriel. You don't want to get rid of any more cards in your hand. Good luck with your little jewel. All right. So, as much as I'd love to have Ayara out, I like the idea of him having to sacrifice a creature. Sacrifice is good. Ariala, but you aren't dumb enough to do that, are you? Because you know. Although she's a flyer, so I don't know if I'll be able to do the damage to her. But the 
does he know that? I don't think he knows that. I don't think he does. Okay, you need to do something now. Like attack or something. Okay. Ah, uh, here you go. Go away, rat. Felipe, no! Do your worst. Exemplar of justice, attack me. I dare you. Over here, poor Rankle. Poor Rankle. Totally just ostracized. Hmm. All right, Legion. Hmm. That's death touch. She's beautiful. sacrifice for that. Sure. Sacrifice. Ooh, it's a toughie. It's a toughie. But I think I want you to have to pay a lot more for her. Sacrifice another black creature and draw a card. I'm going to hold on to this guy for... Ooh, to the battlefield. Oh, I forgot about that. Each opponent discards a card. Ooh, it's a good one. He dies, return target creature. So basically, if I sacrifice him, I get to bring back a converted mana cost to my field, which would make him have to get rid of a card again, which is so good. Sure. Bring back Felipe. Get rid of more cards. Thank you. You see where I'm going? with this do you see do you see 
Mm, poor Felipe. Uh oh. That might be a problem. Okay. Tone it down a little bit, buddy. Gideon Blackblade. Just just chill for a second, okay? I believe in you, friend. I am just about 50% sure in your capabilities. Oh, I don't believe in you. Alright, Felipe. Ooh, man, this is so good. Alright, well, I like this one. So... Each player sacrifices two creatures. So I'm gonna not make a stupid mistake like last time and not use her ability and I'm going to wait a second before I use it. Go Felipe! What will you do, sir? Will you attack with your Legion War Boss after bringing your Ariala and bringing him up to a little bit higher strength so he can attack into my Liliana? Maybe. Perhaps. Perhaps you will do this. Okay. Okay. Let's see where we're going with this. Yes, I realize I had an Elder Spell in my hand that whole time. Uh, I'm an idiot. Oh look, he's doing exactly what I thought he was going to do. But will you attack into my Liliana? Will you do it? Because you know I'm going to hit you with my zombies. Is it worth it? Is it worth it to give up Legion War Boss? Is it? Really? Really? Are you going to do it? I didn't think you would. Because that would be a bad decision. And I draw a card. Thank you. The death. Ooh. So, I should have put him down first. <laughs> uh, we're test playing here, guys. Come on. Each player sacrifices two creatures. So, one way or the other, it's not good for you. But then if I do that, she is definitely dead. <laughs> and I want to keep this party starting. No, Felipe! Draw the card. And draw the card. Sure. Alright. Uh, no attack. Do the thing! Will you attack my Liliana? Will you? 
or will you give up and know that there is no more? Will you? And she's so good. Yeah, that minus nine is just so good. What are your options? He's desperate now, giving my guy the plus one. Exile. Uh oh. With power four or greater. Oh, okay. I see what you're doing there. Exiling. Okay. Hmm. The desperate man, sir. The end of his pitiful rope. What will he do? Mentor. I don't know what you're doing with this, but I don't like it. So I'm going to block two just in case. No idea what you got there, but I'm not letting you hurt her. Hurt. You sank my battleship. Yeah, let's just go ahead and get that out the way. And just take that off there. You need to take care of that problem. Just take care of that little problem right there. Yeah. Let's just do this thing. Because I want to do this thing. Ooh, boy. Sacrifice. Mm hmm. So, attack? If you attack into this, let's do. If I attack into that one, and I attack into that one. <sighs> Go little gutter bones. Go little gutter bones. Because I'm going to do this thing. And draw a card. Yeah. I'll wait. Proceed, sir. Proceed. Well, what you gonna do? Are you going to attack me? So, Aurelia. Is it Aurelia or Aurelia? Or Aurelia. I don't know. Oh, boy, that happened. Let's see that again. Oh, that's a good one.
I love it. Get rid of that card in your hand. You don't need it. Dang. Oh, that's a good one. I get to choose the card. Okay. So we can do this, or we can do the spectacle cost and get rid of a card in their hand. I like that idea! And spectacle? Spectacle, testicle, wallet, and watch. All right, let's do that guy. Yeah, I don't want you to have that card. Oh boy, he. Oh man. Shoot, that's really good too. And he's got a way to get to that one. Oh. Uh, pay two or he gets the treasure token. Hmm. Don't want to do that. Fine. Two, three, four, five, and a six one. It's not cool, bro. It's not cool. I think I need to hold him back for that time wipe. But will he use the Prisoner of Realm on it first? Well, let's pay the spectacle cost instead. For sure. Not like it makes much of a difference, but still. that gain life lose life and attack now will they be so foolish as to use a prisoner realm on my Iara because the commander can be brought back to the command field okay okay Can't activate her. Activate her. <laughs> now what? Oh, resolve this first. Um. Let's see, I have enough to two and then I can bring her out. Can't do that. So if 
I pay two, I'll have cryptic lands to bring out Murderous Rider, but I don't want to bring out Murderous Rider just yet. So I can't really pay for that anyways. Let's pay in this case. Man. They do not want to play their creatures, do they? I'm cool with that. We'll just keep damaging you face. To the face. There we go. Now that you have paid that cost, I want you to go away. Now gooey. Pay. Yeah, I'll pay. Boom, boom. Life link. Now, will you prisoner my murderous rider? Stupidly. Will you do it? Nope. All right. And loses two life. Okay, so I do want to keep it this time. So he will die. Do 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 that one. Oh, what do you have? This is getting out of hand fast. Do not put another creature down. Do not put another creature down. Whatever you cast an artifact, pray over them with very token. Alright. I'm going to not pay that and bring her out. Don't you counter that. Don't you, don't you counter that. I am the master because here. everybody sacrifice a creature dead. From battle to the grave. Sacrifice.
This card is too good. Okay. All them enchantments artifacts come out. If that player can't, they discard a card. All right. survive this so command the dread horde allows me to bring back Liliana and burglar rat so that's six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen Oh, yeah, I can bring her, too. I don't really want that one. Liliana, definitely. Burglar Rat, definitely. Spawn of Mayhem, definitely. That one. Uh, those are all good. I don't want to kill myself. <laughs> You get rid of one of your crummy cards there. All right. Oh, I hope I get that minus nine on her. Come on, give me that minus nine. Mm. Yup. Doom Foretold helps me out with Liliana, yo. That's why I brought her, man. Good times. Good against uh, Bant. Or whatever that was. Yeah. Very, very fluffy. Cool. All right, guys. Well, you see the uh, Brawl Black Mono where her goth-like powers and emo chickness are all wrapped up into one. So uh, pretty, pretty solid deck altogether. Um, yeah, definitely like her. Definitely like it. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to see more deck videos, click the image. I make both Brawl and Standard deck lists, so just choose your path wisely. Also, if you want to support me on Patreon, please click the link in the description.